The one month old baby who was shot along with four adults in Norfolk Tuesday night remains in a hospital tonight under critical condition. Police tell us she is one of the youngest victims to be impacted by gun violence in the city. News three reporter Antoinette Del Bell talked with a family who was calling for justice for the infant and an arrest in this case. The cousin of that little girl tells me she just underwent her second surgery. Now the family is asking for prayers, but they're also asking for the community's help to step up and offer any kind of information that will lead to an arrest of this suspect who committed this senseless act. One month old honesty continues to fight for her life tonight, days after she was shot and left with severe injuries. Just praying day by day. Her mother, Jakiria Brian, taking this photo of honesty just hours before the horrific incident Tuesday night. The family says they were in the courtyard at Lexington Park Apartments in Norfolk when a barrage of bullets struck the infant, her mother, and three other adults. Yes, I was on my front porch and I heard gunfire like. Bleh, bleh, bleh. Brian was shot in the leg. Police say the other adults are expected to be okay. But Honesty suffered extensive damage to her reproductive system, part of her intestine, and both thigh bones. She remains in critical condition. I'm just taking everything day by day, uh, trying to pro process everything. Honesty shown here with her one-year-old sister was born premature. Her family says she was only home for a couple of weeks before gunfire filled her neighborhood. This is unacceptable. Police say there are no suspects in custody. Chief Boone taking to social media Wednesday addressing the violence. Community activist Stacy Robinson echoing his sentiments, saying the rallying cry for change seen around the world needs to address gun violence within the black community. We're not coming out when, when our children are being affected in our community. Meanwhile, Honesty's devastated family is pleading for justice. You know something? Please speak up. I know that you may be afraid, but at this point, we're talking about a baby that hasn't even been here for 30 days. Now, the family has set up a GoFundMe for honesty, and we'll have that information on our website. Meantime, Police Chief Boone tells me they have an idea of who the suspect is. They just need more conclusive information before they move forward on the investigation. In Norfolk, Antoinette Delbell, News 3. The name.